Okay, so hi, my name's Tom Crocker. I'm a product specialist working at Sony Professional Europe, and we are here today at IBC 2017 on the Sony Professional stand. And we've had a number of interesting releases of products this year, but probably the biggest one is, of course, the Venice Digital Film Camera. Now, this has been pretty long awaited. Um, we relaunched the F55 back in 2012, so that's been five years. Now we've got some really significant big news in the cinema space. This is really special probably first and foremost because it's a full frame cinema camera. Now people have been asking us for a long time, can we do a camera that will allow them to use all the old glass they've got on the shelf but some of the really interesting stuff like the anamorphic lenses that they've got as well as full frame DSLR glass too. So this then solves that with a 6K sensor um, across at full frame. Of course it's 4K even if you take a Super 35 cut out of that. So really it comes down to the flexibility of choice of lens and therefore the flexibility of choice of expression. And when it comes to that expression, we've got 15 stops of dynamic range, which we're recording into a 16-bit linear XOCN or RAW file. So particularly for things like HDR production, um, this is going to be a camera that's really going to be able to let you ex examine and explore the really high highlights and the really deep, dark areas of your image for some really expressive cinematography. Um, it's compatible with all of the existing um, accessories for, uh, that are out for the F55, so that's already very, very advanced. And one of the nice things about this camera is we really haven't changed much when it comes to the codec selection internally or the external recording. So this is going to work from day one in your existing post-production pipeline, which is very, very important to people. You don't want to adopt a tool that's going to create more work. You want one that will allow you to focus on the creative aspects. And with that in mind, we've done a huge amount of feedback in the development of this camera, asking professionals from any part of the cinema production daily workflow that's going to touch this camera, how that should be set up, how they should be accessing the different features available to it, which has led us to having features like a large control panel on the AC side, while the operator panel has a much smaller, more limited range of controls, but just what the primary cameraman needs, rather than being possibly a little overwhelmed with all of the functions that a camera like this can perform. So that kind of operation is very, very straightforward. Natural partner for it, of course, is the um, new EL200 viewfinder, which is a very bright OLED full HD panel within the viewfinder, which is really going to, again, show you all of the dynamic range of what the camera can do. Um, the lens mount at the front, of course, we do PL. There's also an E-mount option for it. An E-mount will, of course, allow you to mount pretty much anything via an adapter. So that's also very exciting. Now, the other really big part about this is that this is a very modular camera. So we have the ability to take the entire sensor block out and put a different one in, giving us the scope to firstly perform very easy repairs. If you take the sensor off, which is a simple matter of removing four screws, you can take the fan right out and put that back in. Since that's the only moving part, that means you've got very, very simple onset repairs. You can also, of course, in the future, possibly put in other sensors, allowing the camera to do a range of other things if that's what you need it to. So it's a very, very well thought through and very interesting product. So thanks for watching. If you're interested in more information about Venice, of course, you can visit pro.sony.eu. We're also on all of the social media channels, Instagram, um, Facebook, and Twitter, of course. Just look for Ven Venice or Cinealta. And um, thanks for watching.